Question number one. During which phase does the DNA make a copy of itself? Letter A, prophase. B, anaphase. Letter C, antaphase. Or letter D, metaphase. The correct answer is letter C, interface. Specifically, the interface has three stages. First, the first gap phase where the cell grows. Second, the S or synthesis phase. In this stage, the DNA replicates. The third stage is the second gap phase where the cell prepares for mitosis. Question number two. The phase of mitosis where chromosomes line up at the equator of the cell is called letter A, prophase, letter B, anaphase, letter C, telophase, or letter D, metaphase. The correct answer is letter D, metaphase. During metaphase, all chromosomes line up in the middle of the cell before separating at the opposite poles of the cell. Question number three. During which phase of mitosis do the sister chromatids separate? A. Prophase B. Anaphase C. Telophase or letter D. Metaphase The correct answer is letter B, anaphase. Anaphase occurs after metaphase. Chromosomes break at the centromeres and sister chromatids move to opposite ends of the cell. Question number four. In humans, a gamete will have letter A, 11 chromosomes, letter B, 23 chromosomes, Letter C, 35 chromosomes, or letter D, 46 chromosomes. The correct answer is letter B, 23 chromosomes. A gamete is an, an organism's reproductive cell. Gametes are haploid cells which means they contain a single set of chromosomes. And humans, gametes contain 23 chromosomes. Question number five. After meiosis, they are letter A, two diploid cells, B, four diploid cells, C, two haploid gametes, or letter D, four haploid gametes. The correct answer is letter D, four haploid gametes. Meiosis gives rise to four unique daughter cells, each of which has half the number of chromosomes as the parent cell. Question number six. An organism has 20 chromosomes. It undergoes meiosis. How many chromosomes are found in each daughter cell? Letter A5, B10, C15, or letter D20? The correct answer is letter B10. After meiosis, each daughter cell has half the number of chromosomes as the parent cell. Question number seven. 
If a parent cell has 12 chromosomes at the start of interface, how many chromosomes will each daughter cell eventually have at the end of mitosis? Letter A, 3. Letter B, 6. Letter C, 12. Or letter D, 24. The correct answer is letter C, 12. Mitosis creates two identical cells that each contain the same number of chromosomes as the parent. Question number 8. Which statement is true about mitosis? Letter A, two identical daughter cells are produced. Letter B, crossing over occurs in chromosomes. Letter C, four haploid cells are produced, or letter D, it occurs in germ cells. The correct answer is letter A, two identical daughter cells are produced. Mitosis creates two identical daughter cells. Number 9. The cell in the diagram below illustrates a stage of mitotic cell division. Letter B indicates the letter A ribosome, letter B cell plate, letter C centrioles, or letter D chromosomes. The correct answer is letter C, centrioles. Centrioles help to organize the assembly of microtubules during cell division. Number 10. The diagrams below show stages of mitosis. Which is the correct sequence of these stages? The correct answer is letter C. The first stage of mitosis is prophase, then metaphase, next is anaphase, then followed by telophase. <laughs>